Fab oh fab as I start your message. Now for some of you guys, you are in a new cycle. Okay, um, for some of you guys, this could also be someone that's in a new cycle. There's a couple changes that either needs to be made or that somebody made towards this connection. Okay, um, now for some of you guys, this could be somebody new that is trolling and spying on you. Okay, because that's what we come in and do, baby. We come in and take a look at who is trolling, who is spying on you. For the, so for some of you guys, this is someone um, new that is doing this. This is somebody that you don't even know. Boom, damn. Damn it, not again. And this is somebody that has trolled you or spied on you. Okay, your platform, whatever you're doing, more than one time. Um, this could be someone here also that, like, the change that they could want is with you in some sort of way. It could be for the good, and it can be for the bad. Okay, so let's take a look. <laughs> All right, if you don't know already, I'm your Shaman Empress, a.k.a. the Shaman Hummingbird. Make sure you're subscribed to your area's only placements. Love, Tarot, as well, honey. I'll be reading all the signs and the energies that I see here. Please take what is for you because these are general messages. Show me this person that's fine and trolling on the collective. Messages for the collective, please. We're also going to take a look at what this person wants. All right, let's see. Who is spying and trolling on the collective? Who is spying and trolling on the collective? I told you. <laughs> for some of you guys, I just saw the Ace of Cups. This is somebody new. And this, and for some of you guys, this could be someone here. Yeah, someone here is throwing some energy at you. They like you. The Magician, the Three of Wands, and the Lovers. Someone here is trying to get your attention. This is giving me energy where it's like, yup, they just confirmed that for me. Like, they're picking on you. It's like, the way they're trying to get your attention, I don't think you are going to like it now to once. Sectoria's energy, it's like, the way, this could be someone that's strange, odd, wow. Thank you, Holy Spirit. The Hierophant to Source. This is somebody that wants a relationship. This is somebody that wants a relationship with you. We got the Four of Wands and the Hierophant, Arius Energy. Oh, child, for some of you guys, this is a soulmate. Oh, this is some lemonade. Y'all brought me lemonade today. You got a soulmate, baby. This person has been making decisions about you. Yeah. But they're nervous. Um, you got somebody that feels like you're yep, you're not interested. That's how they're seeing you. As the Queen of Swords. This this person don't think, no, they don't. They don't think you're interested. Um, yeah, three of swords. I, you got somebody here. I, you know. Soulmates is also friends. Soulmates are also whatever. For some of you guys, I, I, I don't know what I got to tell you. I got to give it to you. I got to give it to you, baby. We got the Wheel of Fortune. This in the four ones. This is somebody you clearly have they some kind of connection with this person. It, it, you know, this could be a soulmate, to be honest, that you don't want. I don't know. This is something. This could be somebody here that's at a distance. And for some of you guys, this is somebody that feels like you're maybe you don't want them. Mm. Um, that's why nothing is building between you guys. We have no. This person also hides their pentacles, their money. This is somebody here. That don't like to express the time here. There's no pentacles around this person. This could be also somebody here that is uh like very authoritative, okay? Or they could take like a um maybe authoritative job. They can even work at like in the legal department. But this is somebody to be honest with you. They fail to get your attention, or they're failing getting your attention. This person does watch you. Um, a lot is what they said. 
but they're not, the outcome that they plan is like not happening. They're, this could be somebody at a distance as well. Somebody here could live out of town. This could be also someone here that is feeling like, somebody here is making a decision to keep their distance. But I feel like that's you. <laughs> Child, what? Um, This person really thinks a lot about you. Um, someone here also feels like it wouldn't work because they live too far away. Like this person, yeah, it could live at, in a different city or something like that. Like it's, it's, it could have to do with distance when it comes to this relationship with the world card and the four one, this is about distant. Um, something also for some of you guys that is not going to resonate with the distance is a mileage. This is somebody here. There's a distance between you guys here. And it's like, they feel like they don't fit into your world. Like, um, it makes them upset. They are a little bit depressed. Okay, um, this is also um, an animal lover. This is somebody that will put their animals above humans. Okay, I'm just going to get a button because I know you, some people are like that. Um, but th this person here feels some, some kind of way, okay? Let's take a look at uh, what do they want with you? What does this person want? So that's why they troll you. They're this. They spout on you. This is somebody here that will leave comments, um, you know, on your like Facebook, on your Instagram, your Snap, you know, whatever you have. As well as also what I'm picking up. What do they want with the collective? This person could be bald. Someone here could be bald. Someone here also had some kind of head injury before, um, or something like that. Mm hmm. Yeah. All right, let's see. Someone here is nervous about the decisions that um you you're you are making. If you are what for some of you guys that's going to resonate with somebody new here, this person is nervous that you have made a decision already that this is not going to work for you. Okay. Um this could be a Cancerian um a Libran or a Virgo, a Scorpion, Geminian, Aries, it's Tesaurus is here. What does this person want uh, with the collective? What do they want? Mm. A relationship. And look, that was the four ones, and that's the six of ones that we see, okay, that showed itself. This person here wants a relationship with you for a pentacle. This is somebody here that wants to, now they want to build, with, this is what they want. Here's the pentacles. Somebody here wants to build at least four pentacles with you. Six of cups. They've been thinking about it a lot. This could be someone from your past. Yeah, we got four, four, six, six. Yeah, that's your confirmation. What is this? Oh, the ten of cups. You make this person happy. But there's something that is different. For some of you guys, you could live at different parts of the world or something like that. Um, and maybe it could be religion. It could be spirituality with the hat with spirituality. Okay, I like that. Spirituality. Okay. <laughs> at a distance, but it's something like that. Um, you could be very like guarded. But this person here has a really big cup for you. They see themselves building pentacles with you. This could be someone here that is missing that person to spend time with, to connect to in spirit. Because pentacles also represent spirit, uh, soul, time, energy. Um, and they're missing that. That's what they want with you. Child, damn. You know it's coming. So they could do like, so you know it's coming. They could do like negative things, um, say things, do things that kind of spite you. This person wants to get a reaction out of you. They could have tried and has already failed. Um, this person um, also kind of does, you know, um, hibernation tactics when they get upset. This is also someone here, to be honest, they could be just as spiritual or religious as you or even in a different aspect as you, but may hide at um, here. This person likes to hide their pressures. And this is also someone here that drinks a lot under pressure.
child. We okay. Um, let's get this angel number. Okay, this is crazy, but I, I I love it. This is that new cycle that we were talking about. Ten there. Okay, so we got uh four six four six. Let's take a look at that. Ooh, five fifteen on the clock as well. That's another angel number. We're gonna roll with four six four six. Feel free to add up all the angel numbers that you see here, and we're gonna get a little deeper into this. Okay, so angel number 4646 is all about trust the process. Embrace the changes happening in your life and have faith that they are leading you towards a brighter future. Let go of any doubts and fears and believe in the power of divine guidance. This person wants... It. Someone here believe in this connection. They believe in this relationship. Um, and it's like... They, the other person might simply don't. The, if you guys are not on the same page, okay? Um, you might also feel like y'all have a strong connection or they know that... Um, if you ever talked to this person before, you might have felt like you guys have a strong connection. Okay, let me say this. You ever connect with somebody and it's like you know what I feel like we could be cool or we may have work but because of this and that or that and this I'll never really try it but you know what maybe in another situation or maybe in another lifetime I swear like I, if we would have met we would have been together or something like that that's how you could be seeing it and somebody here is like bunk another lifetime I'm seeing this me and you right now you guys are sitting at two different things. You're like, oh, you know, you, we get along. Somebody here wants to come out the friend zone with you. Soulmates are also friends. This could be like y'all have a friend kind of energy or this is a friend. If this is somebody new, you or can you, this is somebody that's in a straight friend zone with you and it worries and bothers them that you don't notice them or see them or consider in a relationship with them. The four of ones and the four of ones, this person wants a relationship with you. Now, the four of ones is also my twin flame card, 1111. You could be seeing one ones and 1111. If this is your twin flame coming back to form a new cycle, like, or let's say coming into a new cycle with you, they're afraid because of something that you have already known. Y'all have already been through something and you like, you know what, if this didn't happen or maybe we weren't in different situations, you know, maybe I would be with my twin flame. But, you know, she's there or he's there and I'm here. So I'm just going to take it for what it is. This does not sit well with this person. Somebody wants you to notice them. Somebody, yes, they just confirmed that for me. Somebody here wants you to fight for them. This person is trying to get your attention. This is somebody here that completely could be nagging you energetically, nagging you when it comes to the swords here because you're not paying them no attention. The distance is bothering this person. It is bothering this person. Hard. This person wants you. This is somebody here that wants you. This could be somebody, to be honest with you, the King of Cups and the Two of Cups, this person's in love. Um, Yeah, Two of Swords, but, you know, they're going back and forth in their head about it because you are, for some of you guys, I feel like you're, you're so guarded. You so guarded. This could be vice versa. Okay, this could be your twin flame, and, you know, it could be you the other way around, but you're still guarded. But this person has a cup. Let's do some clarifications here. Um, woo, child. Let's see what is going on. All right. So, let's see what is going on here. What's the thing of swords? Um, if this person tried to do something purposely to get your attention or purposely to get at you, they failed miserably. They know it. Yep. This is this damn King of Cups. This is a King of Cups. This person has failed miserably at trying to get your attention, but they watch you. They make comments. They troll you. They spy. They're, and the more they do it, the more they're in their cup. Um, but it's like, what's the Four of Cups? <laughs> I, I don't know why they just won't. Somebody here is trying to beat around the bush. You're supposed to be uh, irritated, but you're not. You're supposed to have said something back smart, but you don't. What's the four cups? 
even if they're like saying some smart shit. Yeah, I told you the Six of Pentacles, you're not giving in. For some of you guys, you have held too much. You have held too much. You have been through too much. Um, yep, the world card in reverse. Oh, yeah. And it's that's see, you have that you're you're you have uh put somebody in a friend zone. Or this is somebody that's in a friend zone, ace of cups. This is a new cycle, this is a new person. Period. Because I'm picking up on strong twin flame energy. Yep, Knight of Swords. This person is trying to make a quick move. Um, this could be also someone here. They don't. They this distance is no longer working for this person. Damn. Damn this distance so ain't. They're not feeling off. it. They're they're not feeling it. What's the Queen of Swords? They're they're trying to put it into the distance. If somebody here is trying to come out of the friend zone with you, with the Queen of Swords. But they already know what you're on. This is Barley. Yep, the High Priestess. Mm -hmm. um, this person here is high in this secretly. They're not telling you this. Oh, child, hold on. You have Three of Pentacles. Now, for some of you guys, this is also somebody here that haven't told you that they have connected, took a chance. They could be, um, you know, have somebody else that you don't know about. For others of you guys, you need to understand that this person does get readings on you. Period. Um, I told you they are throwing some energy at you because they're trying to get you to take a leap of faith. This could also be someone here that's trying to figure out like who you are talking to or shit like that to a sword that are going back and forth in their head. Honey, they getting me dizzy. Okay? They're getting me dizzy. Damn. Um, they're trying to figure you out. What's the nine of swords? Child, this is crazy. What's the nine of swords? Oh my gosh, the nine of pentacles. They're nervous. This is someone here that's nervous that y'all ain't gonna re reconnect. Mm -mm. Y'all ain't. Nope, the hermit. They're they feeling like someone here is starting to feel like you just you y'all ain't gonna connect. Did the, yep, it is making them mad. You could be looking at this also as a very toxic, the moon card, toxic person. Now, someone here could be doing some kind of magic or energy. This look like a little bit dark. Somebody here could get kind of mad and start attacking you. It's also what I'm, yeah, they are. This is somebody here that's getting mad and they're going to start doing magic on you. I, I just, why? I just can't. Like, this shit is starting to be, like, get ridiculous to me. It's like, um, what happened to you just, like, accepting what you did was wrong and giving people space? I just feel like we're in an age where everybody is just, it's like, spell work is almost, like, secondhand anymore. Like, nobody here gives a damn about, like, giving people, like, the right, how can I say this, their right to make a decision, and for some of you guys, you know, maybe right now you just want to be, you know, because of what happened. Something here is, is what's the, what's the hair front? What happened? What's the hair front? And you could have decided to chill right now or you just want a little bit of space. They don't like it, so they're going to do magic. It, this is just, or get somebody to do magic. Like, when is this going to stop? What's the hair front? the chariot and the six of wands okay yeah yeah the magician <laughs> and the seven of wands so for some of you guys you could have just moved on or yep you did eight of wands Th this person is jealous because they feel left out in the cold by you so they want to do this person is into energy magic spells for some of you guys this is dark magic they're going to do some kind of dark magic get somebody to do dark magic on you simply because you walked away yep that's it they just confirmed that. It is what it is. I mean, I don't know what else. To, I can't make it up. I have to tell you what it is. They're mad that you are leaving this out in, uh, out in the cold or accepting this soul contract that y'all were supposed to have for what it is. Give me more of the Wheel of Fortune. The Queen of Cups in reverse. What is this? And the Nine of Wands. They hurt you. This person knows they hurt you. Yup, the Queen of Swords. See? And they know this. They know they hurt you. Yep, the Empress. Someone here knows that they hurt their Empress. And so they're going to do magic on their Empress. Whether you're the man or a woman. Period. And for some of you guys, this is a person that is into spells. Period. There's just no getting around it. It's like, what the fuck? Oh my gosh. 
Um, I'm just want to see something real quick. What is this? Yep, page of cups. And I knew it. And now for some of you guys, I'm going to tell you something right now. You might have a child with this person. And this is somebody here that will also do things here. This person um, will get you pregnant or get pregnant by you. Just so you know that. <sighs> Show me more. What is the... F Thank you. The chariot in reverse. In the tower card. This is somebody here to be honest with you. It, it, they, it, it, it's like they want you to hurt. Yep. Someone here is mad about this distance. They're mad about you moving on. Point blank period. Okay. If this is somebody new for some of you guys, let's say this ancient twin flame that you're going to um, meet, just know this is exactly what's going to happen. This is a soulmate. This is because there's a contract here. This is exactly what this person is going to do. So, um, so for, let's just break this down real quick. You meet somebody new, whatever you, y'all, y'all do have, this is a soulmate you're supposed to meet, you're supposed to have an encounter with. Y'all end up, um, going your separate ways. This is what they're going to, um, result to doing. Just so you know that. And then this is also somebody here that wants to come back to you guys to do, to hold you back, to do the same thing. And it's going to blow up right in their motherfucking face. The queen of cups. Yep. This is somebody here. This this child. This person has got got issues. Yep, they do. Uh, uh this person got issues. This is somebody here. To be honest with you, they can't never really let you go. This is somebody here that will build you up to break you down. They will come back to make up with you here just to cause towers purposely. This is also someone here that will always experience a tower here because they're doing this to their true a, a counterpart. Y'all are counterparts. This is, for some of you guys, you're supposed to play an empress or an emperor role in this person's life. So they're also going against certain universal laws. That's why it keeps coming up in the tower, and they're probably going to feel the tower the most. This person's in the nine of swords, four of cups. This is somebody here that quietly suffers from depression. They'll never tell you. Anxiety, they'll never tell you. Period. Let's see what else is going on here. Let us be honest, child. We're going to be on here for a goddamn hour. What else is going on here? Almighty, oh, beautiful universe and holy spirits. What else? Yep, this is toxic. This is poison. You guys already know this. This is possibly why you just ain't with it. Look at all this shit. I can't even take all this shit, child. Dang. Damn it, Dad. Yeah, look, damn moving on physical moment. change. For some of you guys, this is somebody here. You might have to move away from this motherfucker. I'm just telling you right now, this is somebody here you can't you can't trust them. For some of you guys, I don't blame you. Someone here will also do magic on your house. For some of you guys, this is energetic, and for some of you guys, it's literal magic. Hope and praying and yearning. Period. And for some of you guys, you this is your divine masculine. This is your divine masculine. And I'm telling you right now, clear cleansing and divine masculine. This is somebody here that you're gonna have to continue to cleanse your energy. From and I hate to say this, if you let this person back, God damn, I'm good. Damn it! Woo! So we got entrapment off. and motherfucking pregnancy. And you guys not only say this shit when it gets real, and because we ain't serving tea today, we serving lemonade. Bitch, run, cause this I don't give a fuck. Sometimes you gotta run from your soulmate. These motherfuckers, don't, when it gets to these contracts, it gets fucking real. Happiness and surviving daily hustle. This is somebody that's supposed to be happy with you. This could be also someone that knows they could have been happy with you and y'all could have had some kind of success together. Yeah, honey, this person is watching you. This is somebody here that's watching you in your sleep. Mother they, this motherfucker is watching you right now. They probably watch you watch this motherfucking reading. I'm just saying. Realization. This is somebody here that's having... This person is, like, upset with you because y'all ain't together and you're okay with it. I, I, that's what I'm getting. I'm. That's what it is. This. this it. It happens. What do they want to say? Mm -mm -mm. They feel like y'all have unfinished business together. What's this? It's simply really. How do I feel? I want you us forever. Yeah, my dreams. This is also somebody that realized that you guys have like a contract. I'm telling you, a contract, all of this. This is somebody here, to be honest with you. Another tower I'm seeing here is pregnancy. And it's purposely being done here. Just so you know that. Oh my God. I just saw, I'm sorry, it's on. I see you looking good and moving on. I don't care who you are talking to. I'm better. I will compete for you. Boom, bam, motherfucker. There it is. I can't make it up. 
this is what's wrong. This is somebody here, honey, they will, they don't mind doing, I'm going to get my Harry Potter one. They don't mind going to Harry Potter, honey. You need to know this. Um, emotional intimacy. This person can feel you. Yes, they just confirmed that for me. This is somebody, they can feel you. You can feel this person. I'm done. I'm fucking done. Oh my gosh. Twin, for some of you, this is your twin flame. Oh my gosh. Y'all. I, I don't know what to say. Because this is your twin flame, y'all. Just This is not funny. But it's like, why are you like this? What is wrong? I need mean, you, child. I don't know what to tell. I just, I, I'm telling you. But I don't know what to tell you. This this person is not, I, I don't think this person is, I don't think, if, if, you, if you think you get, I don't know if you can get away. Some of you guys might, I'm going to tell you right now, I know you're not going to want to hear this. But it might be best that you, y'all might not need to live in like in the same city. I don't think it's healthy for the city. Damn it, damn it, damn it, damn it, damn it. <laughs> I'm, I'm sorry. This is ridiculous. Because this person is going to continuously try to break you up from other people. This, it, it, it's, oh my gosh. I, I don't, I, I'm, I'm trying, y'all. I'm pushing. I really, really am. You might really have to consider moving in a different part of this city, state, because this person, this y'all can't, it's too much. Seeing you move on, seeing you looking good as you moving on, um, friend zoning them, it, it, this is going to turn out like this. And it could be cycles of it. You could be um being pushed to move away. Because y'all have, un, it's, it's, it's an unfinished energy. It's like, what, Why? Throwing magic. For some of you guys, y'all could be throwing magic at each other on different levels. What else is going on here, child? What's the feelings and emotion? Almighty, beautiful, universal, holy spirits. My apologies. Can you? Thank you. Pandora's box. Ancestors in reverse. This person ain't seeing a karmic anymore. No, they're not. Uh, there could be a karmic that... Uh, this person is no longer seeing. There's there's no more third parties if that was an issue. Um, this is also someone here, to be honest, their ancestors may not be supporting them. There's things that you don't know. Pandora's box is also in reverse. Um, yeah, magical moments. Um, the, the, someone here could have lost like um, support from certain ancestors because of the, the magic that they're doing. You don't know about yet, though. Yeah, this person, you, your twin flame's going through an ego death. And to be honest, it could be like a midlife crisis um, that they're having. They have had a realization about y'all. And it's hard for this person to deal with this. Now, I know we kiki and all that. And, you know, um, and that's cool as part of it um, as well. Because there's different levels to it. Everybody's not going to recognize this on the same energetic level or frequency but others of you guys i'm gonna tell you right now your twin flame is having a midlife crisis and it doesn't need to go physical because it, it could i'm just going to tell you this is somebody here if they was to see you with somebody they might flip the fuck out just saying uh, i'm just saying so y'all need to figure out what's going on here. You know, what, how do you coexist in the world? Damn. We got the third choir. Yep. Mm -mm. Yeah, justice. Justice is, is being played out. Just could be justice being played out for you, but it ain't justice for them, honey. We got Archangel uh, Megatron. This is definitely a contract um, here. It's, it's, it's already set in stone. It's done. This person is aware of... Of y'all's contract, we have W. Uh, could be specific here. Yep, we got the second uh, second choir here, honey. Oh boy, the cherubims. Um, this the cherubims could be trying to help your person. Um, you know, get closer to their spirit guides, their spirit teams. Um, they could have um trying to get back on track because they have lost their ancestral support. Usually when twin flames go like this, that's definitely you guys that's resonating with the twin flame. Um the ancestors can't they won't they won't support. 
Okay. This is also, um, you know, you could be getting support from their ancestors and they're not. Okay. Like sometimes they will have to support the one because you guys share the same ancestors because y'all share the same soul. We have you, we have Z, and we have L. Okay. Oh boy. All right. Let's get a love oracle message, honey. I also just saw the ninth choir. So I'm sorry. Let's get this, child. Mm. I'm seeing these, so we're rocking with these. Then we'll pull you an oracle. This person um, could know that you don't like, uh, they lost your trust. Somebody here is tripping out because they lost their, they lost their counterpart. That's exactly what's going on here. This could be someone here. You know, their last result could be doing dark magic and they're willing to do it. They feel like they have nothing else left. Just to be honest with you. Yep, dark deal, wrong decision. It was a wrong decision. Um, Yep, a night of passion. This is also someone here, to be honest with you. They could feel like, you know, they could regret because of how they feel about you. You know, uh, y'all even going there. Like, damn, why? This could be someone here that's also questioning twin flame situation. Like, damn, why? I should have never talked to my twin flame. Why I got to be a twin flame? You know, why? You know, because they could feel like they, this person could be, for some of you guys, having a very tough time. Is they're, they're having a tough time, baby. Yep, I'm required love. Because they don't feel the love in the union no more. Um... They could feel like you have changed. Yeah, this person is very aggressive. This is also someone that wants to dress up to dress up for you and give you loyalty. Look, misunderstanding. There's a misunder. This person is aware. There's a misunderstanding. They understand they hurt you. For some of you guys, you might feel different, or you could be right now saying, "You know what? My twin flame and me. I know we have a contract, but we're on ice." Oh my gosh. All right, let's get an oracle, y'all. I am seeing these cards they're showing me. So let's get that. Solitude, yeah. Yeah. And we also have blessings, okay? For some of you guys, um, y'all ain't talking. They are aware. You could be doing real good right now or just good. Just doing you, just, you know here but this is also someone here that could they know that you guys could have been like very blessed together the will of fortune brings abundance to unions all right especially when you're doing with it with with, with you and your contract because that's what you came here to do and you are actually answering that okay what's this what's this oh boy so we got yeah memories in reverse um, now someone here could be also doing some kind of magic to try to make like a race of bad memory. And this is supposed to change the fate between y'all. Yep, discernment and feelings. Because they're, they, they're, what they're trying to do is make you feel for them again. This could be somebody here that feels like if they could erase your memory and make you unthink something bad that happened, it might change the will over time. Patience. That could be what they're doing here because they plan on returning back. And that's the truth. Damn, y'all. Ooh. That was a damn it um, Wow. All right. Let's get y'all some signs and plans. I mean, and plan it now. I can't. I'm. I'm just blown away. Yeah, we got the um the sixth house, honey. The house of Virgo. Someone here is really like having issues. Uh, they could like their anxiety could be like crazy. Mm -mm -mm. Yep, we got the ninth house, Sagittarius, and we got Uranus. This person here is popping in and out your dreams, change, uh, aqua areas. We're in a new world. This person here could have noticed this. Yep, this person's in their feelings because um, it's almost like on a quantum level, Pisces. You know, um, they understand. This person understands more than you know. I'm telling you, revenge. Confession of love. 
This is a twin flame that wants revenge because they're in love. It, 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 but when this person fell in love, the cycle has already changed. Neptune. So they pop in out your dream and they do magic. Jupiter, yep. Yeah. Well, a fortune is Jupiter energy. It's also a contract. Oh my gosh. I've got to say this one more time. For some of you guys, if this starts to go bad, the world is a very big, small place. You really might have to consider, like, moving to here because you guys living too close together could be detrimental. And that's the best way I can say it. And I got to say allegedly because we on YouTube. I'm going to shut it down right there, guys. I love you all. I'm praying for you guys, too, because we are in the era where things have separated the contracts. And it people are grieving. People are hurt. And this twin flame, I do see the hurt here. The hurt. Both of you guys could be hurt. This could be confirmation. Maybe you don't know this. I don't think you do. But your twin flame is hurt. Stay dope. I love you all. Hit that bell. Hit all that keeps you tapped in and tuned in and notified when your messages are ready and available for you, baby. Okay. I love you. I'll see you the next time you stop by. I'll shake any mind.